Hey y'all, it's your girl Stace in the place and today we are going to go over the $5.95 sale for the fragrance mist at Bath & Body Works which is available this Saturday and Sunday. I was trying to think of what the date was but of course it's not popping up in my brain right now. Oh wait, it'll be on my receipt. It was... So today's the 3rd and tomorrow is the 4th of February. Um, perfect timing to, you know, get a little Valentine's Day gift in. But let's get into the bags. You know why we're here? Okay, so all of this stuff that I'm going to show you, I only spent $19.10, baby. Isn't that wild? It's going to be so wild. Okay, so our first fragrance mist that we have for the day is the Sweet Cherry. Um, wait, yeah, Sweetheart Cherry, my bad, excuse me, um, Water Lily Springs and Sea Salt Coast. These are the three babies that I decided to bring home with me. I think they're great choices, but I'm unbiased, of course. Um, also, in this little bag of bags here, we have a Water Lily Springs um, Travel Care Body Cream. Um, I also, I saw... I was watching someone else's video and they were saying that they enjoy picking up the body cream um, over the hand um, cream and I also agree with that. I also love um, the lid on this one because the other lid, it's like, can I, like, can I pay more attention and put it on? Yes, sure, but I usually don't. So I'm like, no, I feel safer with this and plus I feel like you get, well, you definitely get more product in this one. Um, but yes, so picked up this one with a birthday reward so that was free nine to nine um but let's get into these three this is the main reason why we are here um so sweetheart cherry i you know it, there have been some different stories all about and around the town about this little girl right here um so let's see let's get some skin out <laughs> and i'm gonna spray it I'm gonna spray this little at the back of my hand. Come on, pump it up. All right, the three sprays. So when I smelled it in store, because as you all know, when you smell something in store, it smells, it's, you know, it like you could get a good gist of it, but you're also smelling it in an environment where there's other competing smells, and then you're also not smelling it on your body. So, you know, it's a little give and a little take there. Um, so when I smelled it in the store, it reminded me a little bit of the, um, Sol de Janeiro, the, excuse you, the original one that came out in the yellow packaging, and then um, Trader Joe's has like their own little version and vibe, um, the Brazilian nut butter version. So, those are my first thoughts, um, but as I'm smelling it here, mm, okay, definitely getting the pistachio, definitely mad at myself that it took forever to purchase this one. Because I, y'all, you will not believe this, but I have not been inside a Bath and Body Works since January 6th. So, like, <laughs> your girl was trying her best to stick to a low buy. So, I would see that everyone picked this up and I'm like, oh, I need to pick it up. I hope it doesn't sell out. But it probably could. Uh, I wouldn't be surprised. Um, and also, what was his name? Um, Paul Reacts also, like, promoted this on his page and stuff. So, like... I wouldn't be surprised if this one just magically disappears because everyone's going to pick it up with the um, body mist sale and I, I highly recommend this one. If you enjoyed um, pistachio toasted vanilla, if you like any pistachio scents, I would highly recommend this. It, even if you're not a huge cherry fan, I'm not, like, I pick up some of the cherry, but it's not, like, that medicinal, like, oh, kind of cherry at all. Also, I'm slightly annoyed because I worked so hard. Okay, not that hard, but, like, I moved the desk so I could be closer to you guys, and but still be able to see the pups. And, of course, like, they don't want to work. They just, they just up and left. I guess they think it's their lunch break or something. They're off the chain. Mm -mm -mm. Yes, I'm staring Sterling down right now because she's looking at me. Oh, here she comes. She might be coming back. Maybe we can guilt her into popping back up. But as of right now, my co-anchors suck. Okay. I hope you're back. 
anyways, anyways, sorry, I'm getting all distracted. But yes, I'm loving this one. I would highly recommend this one. You know, I know it says cherry. And there's definitely some cherry there, but it's not overwhelmingly cherry. That pistachio and the vanilla base just like gives a little. Now, I remember this guy shops. Hey, boo. Unfortunately, he did not like this one. That was so sad. I was like, oh no. Um, but I feel like if you enjoy the Kayali um, pistachio ice cream um, perfume, Tux, are you feeling it too? You like it? like oh, I guess so um <laughs> it's like anything pistachio almondy like that kind of vibe I feel like you'll like it and enjoy it um also when you're picking if you're specifically going for this one make sure that you pay attention and look for it with the cherries because they also have the strawberry pound cake one that's very similar like the colors are almost the same and if you're not paying attention you could easily pick up one um of the strawberry pound cake instead of this one however I would say if you like strawberry pound cake or if you're looking for a nice gift for someone for Valentine's Day, just go ahead and pick up this one and the strawberry pound cake. But just make sure you pay attention because you don't want to get it and then get home and be like, what the heck? That's not the one I meant to pick up. Um, next up, we have Water Lily Springs. Um, this one, oh, this one is nice. I like this one. Is this the musky one? Yes. This one is Dew, Dew Kissed Lilies and crisp waters and clean musk and you know you know i'm here for a muskiness musk and yes i'm spraying three sprays on myself because i am like i am done i am so done with trying to like protect things and hold on to them at all costs so i'm like nope i need to enjoy them i need to live the life live the dream and carry on and if i need another one it's fine i'll pick up another one during semi-annual sale but the way that life goes, um, I'm just letting like the air kind of help dry this down. Oh, that's why I'm waving back and forth like a lunatic. Um, but anyhow, let's see. Oh, yes, this one. This hits. This one hits. It's like it's just the the it's the it's the muskiness of it all. It's the muskiness of it all. Meanwhile, Tux is probably like, why did I even come over here? Oh. Yes, Lord, I should have picked up another one. Wow. Oh, it just smells so clean and soapy. And that muskiness is like a little bit of body in there. Just, oh. Oh, that, that one is good. That, that one is definitely good. Like, if you like clean and musky scents, Pick up this. Matter of fact, this one is regular $18.95. So pick up, pick up two. Okay, pick up two. I should have picked up two. Dang. Right after I said all that about not hoarding. <laughs> it's whatever. It's whatever. Okay, so here's Sea Salt Coast. We're going to spray this right here on the inner elbow and work it in. Um, the notes for this one is salt, <laughs> salty air water lotus and sandalwood shoals you sound like it's up my alley i mean you know you know i love these freshies okay 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 i mean it's a vibe i feel like i'm out there on the ocean and like i don't know like it's clean it's fresh out there there's no seaweed and like the little bit of sandalwood gives it like this elevated little vibe Matter of fact, I'm gonna put it on the back here because I don't want it to get too close to the musk because y'all already know I was loving the musk. Oh, still a little wet. This was pretty good too. I think this one is good for people who um, have allergies. Well, I don't know if people have allergies, but people who are sensitive to smells, they can't really take like a super strong smell. However, if you're not a huge fan of sandalwood, then I would be a little bit cautious, but. This one is going to be perfect for the summer, for sure. And that's the thing. It's like, I was actually kind of shocked that these were out because I'm like, well, yeah, it's springtime, but I feel like these would be, I don't know, in my mind, I would think these would be more late spring, early summer scents, but, you know, who am I? I, I still bought them, so.
Yeah, this one's nice, but it, it's not, it's not, it doesn't hit as good, as strong as this one. But it is good. This one is escape to a place where fresh water glistens and salt water waves splash the shore. It's time to relax and refresh. I agree. Um, I feel like this is kind of similar to fresh getaway but it's not like it's the same thought and the same vibe the same process but it's not this the exact same sense but like if you enjoyed fresh getaway then you might would also enjoy this one but yeah it's just like a nice aquatic -y, but like beachy kind of scent and vibe with the sandalwood but you miss and i gotta smell this one again i'm sorry Okay. Matter of fact, like, you know, I thought that this one was going to be my absolute favorite out of all of them, but like, I don't know, today, I'm just, I'm just feeling this one, so, yeah. <sighs> that must, honey. Mm, 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 mm. Okay, so, these are three that I picked up after I've had, um, all this joy and excitement. Um, <laughs> I did not pick up Calypso Clementine. I I smelled it and it smells like you know those little tiny cutie oranges and it just I don't know it didn't do it for me it didn't really like tickle my fancy but again I'm not a huge fruit um lover so you know take my feelings and opinions with a grain of salt um but if you are not a fruit lover and you're at all curious if you should pick up Calypso Clementine I would say proceed with caution um, but these three for me were great ones to pick up. They had so many different body mists in store. A lot of them I already had, um, so I didn't have to worry <laughs> about trying to pick up a whole bunch. Yeah, are you guys, are you guys fighting over there? What's going on? What's the beef? What's the drama? Okay, so we have um, vanilla. I finally picked this one up. Finally. <laughs> and then... Purple patchouli, um, you guys saw the previous video, like, I absolutely love that purple patchouli candle, and I was actually in shock because when I was in the store, um, I could not believe that I only saw four of them, so I picked up two, um, and then I also picked up the Sweetheart Cherry as well to try that one out, and it wasn't a bunch of these, I mean, there were two different sections of them, so... They had a decent amount, but I could easily see that, you know, if someone's out there um, selling, like how our girl Sneeko be out there selling, honey, they, they go be buying them up when they get the sweet cherry mist and the um, candle, you know. She be hooking people up, honey, and she probably will throw in a, um, <laughs> throw in a hand soap, too, because I've be, I be watching her. I'll be like, mm -hmm. that's how she be getting us to buy more. Um, so yeah, I don't know. I wouldn't be shocked to see these just magically start slowly disappearing as Valentine's Day is coming up. And it smells lovely to me. I don't know. We'll have to put on the warmer and I'll let you guys know how it goes. But, um, yeah, so all of these five items were picked up with rewards. Um, and then I paid the sale price $5.95 plus tax for these. Also, special thanks to Justin, and I believe his name was Joey. They were so sweet. Um, so they're ringing me up. And then, you know, like, I don't know if you all run into this, but sometimes it can be so aggravating because if there's a sale, then, um, and you're trying to use the rewards as well on the same transactions, like, it kept taking my $16.95 reward and putting it on this and then making me pay $16.95 for one of the candles. And so they were able to rework everything um, to make sure that I picked up this for the $5.95 price. And then I was able to get my um, reward items for free by using the reward. Um, so special thanks to them for their kindness and their patience. Because <laughs> I was just like, my total came to $30. So I was like, wait a minute. <laughs> The devil is a lie, because wait a hot second. Now, I, in my mind, it was like, it's going to be $18 and some change. Like, we, at most, like, come on. Um, so, yeah. So, special thanks to them. Everyone in the store was super lovely. Um, it was great to go in the store early in the morning before the chaos um, started. Um, so, yeah. So, I hope that this is helpful. Um, again, highly recommend 
These three, if you need an easy gift one, um, definitely strawberry pound cake, champagne toast. Oh, they even have chasing fireflies, but I already have, I think I have two of them, so I didn't pick up another one, but I'll, I was tempted. Also, Luminous is there for those of you who love and enjoy Luminous. This would be a great time to pick up a backup of that one as well. Um, but yeah, so we are going to go and figure out what's our game plan for lunchtime. And thank you all so much for checking in and watching our video. We'll see you in the next one. Bye.